All right, we got our buddy Jimmy over here. He just got back from the world famous uh, paint swap meet out in uh, Decatur, Texas, or Fort Worth, whichever you want to call it. And instead of picking up a car, he decided to pick up a wagon. Now, when I look at this wagon, I'm talking about, I don't think it's worth a fucking nickel, but he says it's worth a lot of money. Believe it or not, he gave $5,000 for that wagon. Now let's talk to Jimmy and see what the fuck's so uh, exciting about this wagon that costs 5000 He says it's worth 10000 All right, what's up, Jimmy? What's the situation? Got me a big block 427 wagon here. A big block 427 <laughs> wagon. Couple of couple of horsepower. Yeah, Got a couple, right. couple of mules. Why is this thing worth five grand? Dude? I don't understand. You well, said it's worth ten thousand. It's fully restored. Look on the net. See if you find. See, huh? see, look and see if you I'm find. I'm asking you why it's I'm worth ten thousand. You look and see if you find an 1893 Owensboro, Kentucky covered wagon with the original saves and the cloth inside. Hold on, original what? Well, look here. The seats. We know you're a Texan, but the seats of... are inside. These are little stays that go on top. I got the cloth inside. This is what. This is your 1893 suburban. This is what you drive. This was you, like the uh, Cadillac. Of 1893. This is what you rode in when you drove. You going out west? Well, why was that, dude? Because of the spring setup or what? No, it's just what is this. It's either this or you ride a damn mule. Wow. Look at this. See this plate? It says Owensboro right there, yeah. 37. That is the authenticity of it. These sides have been replaced by the Amish about 20 something years ago. So when this. All the running gear is original 1893. Jeez. So you think this was an Amish wagon up from Maryland no, or something? No. The Amish replaced the side doors and the bottom. All this, these 1 by 12 pine are not original. All this oak down here is all original. So this is all original. All this uh, gear we're looking at right here, huh? Yeah. Wow. What's this up here, bud? What's that, tourniquet or something that makes well, a turn? Hang, hang on. Are you going to show us a little secret? Well, I got to unload it. Got to take off. Well, unload that bastard. Don't run into my truck, my Dodge truck. Man. Yeah, what's the heck of uh, Bruno up to this right here? Yeah, look right. Bruno up to this. Wow, what do you think, Charlie? How heavy is that thing, Jimmy? Long, it's light. See that long tongue? That's what yeah. goes to here. It goes all the way up front for your mule. Ah, dude. How long would it take to hook some horses up to that thing? Five minutes. So, when it was freezing ass cold in the middle of the winter, this was your transportation to town. Am I right? It's either that or horse. Foot. So, so, how do you think this wagon got down here? You think it took the old Chisholm Trail straight into Dallas? Or? No, this guy, this is. From, Where's this guy from? The guy I got it from is from Missouri. So, he brought it down from Missouri. Right. And I could have sold it three times before I left the swap with people all over this thing. I think I would have sold it and bought me a rat rod, bud. What do you think of those rat rods? Well, how many rat rods do you find out there? Probably 30. How many wagons you find? One. How many rat rods? You like rat rods, bud? Yeah, this what is my rat, rat rod. This is my rat rod. This is a rat yeah. rod, bud. See, this I got is a rat, rat rod wagon. Hook my rats up to this. So you got a rat it. rod. There you go. You got the rust on it. You got the old wood. Uh, you know, it's Check a it rat out. rod. Check it out. See that? See this, up, see this thing right here? Yep, this is that's the wrench that turns these nuts. Hold on, that's a that's a wheel wrench. Yeah. Huh. Well, how do you get that wheel wrench off of there, dude? Take this clip out of the bottom, you pull it out. Oh my here. gosh! Get your tongue, put your tongue in there, put it back in there. And that's what that's what. Did you see? Did you see that, Charlie? This is your rack. This pinion. is called uh, your rack, and rack, and there's your pinion. This is modern <laughs> ingenuity back from. Look at that, dude. It's it's got a crack in it, but I don't know if I take my. No, well, this That's wrench is not one. original. Oh. This wrench was made oh, okay. to fit the lug nut. But you're going to take that. You're going to go get a new one, man, because well, I'd hate to see you get a flat on that on this thing. And yeah, it'd take a lot. They go rock and flat. Change wheel. the spare, bud. You know, because you don't have the right lug nut wrench. So, uh, wow. You going to put? You, my, you look at here. You got the fine tuned Model A suspension. You can't go wrong with that, bud. Is that original, Jimmy, or did somebody add that? Those leaf springs, bud. Okay, Jimmy's on the phone. Jimmy's on the phone right now, and uh, you know he's a big business guy. But uh, look at the intricate steel structure, uh, you know, framework we got going here. It's just uh, meticulously drawn out. The modernized wagon has come back to life, Jimmy. 
independent breath This is your suspension. independent suspension right here. Look at this, watch it. She's barely touching it, and look at that. Rides like a Cadillac in the ocean, bud. Did you see that? The front shakes that way, and the back shakes that way. So when you push it again, see it goes like this. Look at it. Look at the twisty action, bud. There you go. See that? That's a nice comfort. So is this where you would sit? Is this the buck board here? Is that what they call that? This is your foot floorboard. The seats oh, the are foot. inside. The seats set on top. Okay, that's a foot board. Okay. And this is like the... This is where you keep all your valuables, right? It's just a little box. Do you think this uh, this thing ever got uh, caught in any Indian raids or stagecoach robberies or anything? They don't tell them. Let me ask you this, bud. Do you think anybody got killed on this wagon from an arrow? Charlie. Maybe. I mean, if the wagon can talk, man, you know, it'd have a story. Us, oh, hell yeah. Wow. Kind of like nothing. How about laying inside that thing when we okay, talk let's the story? See. The yeah. sheets are inside that. They yeah, that would make a good uh, wagon, you know, go out and back yourself a little uh, cup of water out of the water. Is this a water bucket, Jimmy? Water, whiskey, whatever you want to put in. Because I see you got the bucket there. Now, we know this wire isn't from 1893, but... No, this is probably from the 1920s or 30s. Okay. Like I say, I just bought it. It is not restored to how I'm going to use it. You look like you're nervous on film, but are you nervous? I don't give a fuck. Okay, there you go. Well, what's this here for, Jimmy? Come here. I see you got the modern wire ties holding on. That's nice. I like that. Okay. So that means this is actually for looks, right? That's just, that's all you're this, really not going to use it. All that. this is is a bit and a bridle. It's but it's not be. really a usable. It's just, it's just. It's the bling, this. man. That's the bling. There you go. You got a little. Oh, yeah, bling. there you go. The bling. That's it. That's the yeah. bling. That's the, that's like the dice that you put on your rearview mirror. Yeah, that's, that's just a little cheap one. Yeah. Way right back in the early 1990, Oh, yeah, bling. right. Uh huh. Then you got the leather strap, you know, in case mama's in the wagon with you late at night and you want to get a little kinky. <laughs> uh, we got the strap to take care of that situation. <laughs> then you got the big old seat. Wow, that seat's big, dude. Is that the seat I'm looking at? The other two up. They set them top. Two seats? Yeah, one to drive and one to the back. Oh, one in the middle. Okay. Yeah, where you want to, the jacket. We got wire ties over here holding our bolts on. What's yeah, up? So we got a little modern technology mixed in with old school technology. I like that, bud. That's really fancy. And, uh, Jimmy, I appreciate you showing us your wagon. Uh, wow. That's all I can say. You know? It's a hoopty ride. It's a it's a it's a four-wheel drive ride. It's a it's a rat ride. It's a custom show car uh, wagon wheel. Uh, Beverly Hillbillies. Hell, it's all mixed in one. It's whatever the hell you want at the time that you want it. Thanks a lot, Jimmy. We'll see you later. See you down the trail, fellas. See you down the trail over on the Chisholm Trail. That's the only trail I know that runs through Dallas. Fort Worth. Chisholm <laughs> Trail, bud. It's a Fort Worth Chisholm Trail. Do what you said. It's not gonna roll off easy. Take it easy, this is Pete. Wagon, train, here we come. John Wayne, Clint Eastwood, and everybody else involved. See you later, take it easy. Just don't know what's gonna happen over here at Pete's place. It's crazy like that, it's crazy. So now we gotta restore a fucking wagon. Hey, Jimmy, are we gonna re be restoring that wagon? I want some flames on it. Are we gonna restore that wagon? No, oh, that yeah. flames. So I ain't going to make no money off you on this job. Okay, Charlie might be out of work for a couple weeks on that one. See how it is. No worky, no pay. See you later. Take it easy. Charlie, good job, bud. You don't talk a lot, but whatever the fuck you do here, you do good. See you later. Let's hope he doesn't run into my fucking truck here. Hey! Don't you think somebody ought to be in the back here? Let me put my camera down. I don't want you running into my truck. Hold on. 